Hey what's up guys uh, this is Chatura from AntiVFX and in this video we are going to take a look at how to stretch and shrink uh, audio clips inside Adobe Audition. For example uh, you have an audio track uh, that is uh, 5 seconds long and you want to stretch it to uh, 10 seconds or you want to shrink it to uh, 2 seconds that is possible inside Adobe Audition without uh, without uh, distorting the audio right uh, sometimes uh, these techniques uh, will help when you are um, syncing music to the video right so when you add sound effects to your video or animation you can use these techniques so let's take a look at how to stretch so the one thing you need to uh, remember is when you stretch a music file it will change the tempo of that music file right so it will slow down the audio if you shrink it it will speed up the audio music right so you need to understand so let's so i have added a clip uh, to my multi track editor on uh, this track one let's play the original sound now you can hear the original state right so in order to stretch or shrink clip inside audition you need to enable global clip stretching when you go to this option you can see that uh, toggle, toggle global clip clip stretching you must turn on this or you can use this uh, menu bar and go to clip and stretch and enable global clip stretching first you need to enable this right so when you enable this global clip stretching uh, when you hover the mice mouse cursor to this point this ending point you can see we will get a clock icon and uh, text like uh, stretch that means uh, we have enabled the clip stretching and we can uh, stretch by dragging the clip to the point where we need now we stretch it to uh, 15 seconds so when you play back the audio file again now it is much slower it changed the uh, tempo of the audio file and it stretched the audio file you can also uh, shrink this uh, audio file to a smaller time duration right it will speed up the music file right so now you can see that we speed up the audio file and you can see here how the percentage of the uh, adjustment to the clip speed right so it's uh, original state is 100% when you increase the duration uh, it will increase the percentage and because we shrink this clip uh, it is 46% uh, percentage. when you go to the properties panel you can see some other options you can uh, if, 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 you are, if you are working on a slower computer, turn on the rendered. That means uh, you can, uh, the audition will create a rendered version of this uh, audio file and you can see high quality uh, sound uh, if you are on a slower computer. Or uh, you can select another algorithm too, like uh, monopho monophonic is the default uh, algorithm that audition used to stretch these uh, music files you can if you if, if you don't think that uh, this doesn't sound great you can change the algorithm to polymorphic uh, sometimes you get a better result with uh, polymorphic algorithm right so when you play back right so now you can see that how we have stretched the uh, audio clip uh, if you're not satisfied with the pitch you can change the pitch uh, using this uh, pitch control you can increase the pitch or you can uh, decrease the pitch based on your requirements or you can keep the default uh, it is a uh, audition when when we stretch clips inside audition audition uh, maintain the pitch so that's why we can get uh, very good quality audio when after even we are stretching the clip you can also use uh, these ma stretching method to speed up or slow down uh, the songs if you want to uh, hear a uh, slow motion of your favorite song you can bring it into the audition and you can stretch it right so that way you can listen to the so slow slower version of your favorite song so this is the method that we use uh, the stretching inside audition